Welcome back to another episode of Grey's Zone Warfare. We're going to be working on the tasks that take us to Hunter's Paradise. So first we have On the Range from Gunny. Let's take a look at our rep. Probably need two more quests for him. And we'll be able to uh, get Gunny level two, which will be very helpful. Let's see here. On the range. Okay, here's the thing. Our supply situation still isn't great, and that's a big understatement. Believe me. Since the entire place is under an international quarantine, sending anything our way is proving very difficult. Simply put, if we don't make use of anything that can help us, we're done for. There is some kind of luxury resort in the north of our AO. You know, the kind that definitely wasn't meant for the locals unless they were scrubbing the toilets there. It sticks out like a sore thumb, so you can't miss it. However, it's the building just west of it that interests me. Looks like the top 1% staying at the resort wasn't satisfied, which is laying by the pool and tanning their rich asses, but they also wanted some action. Naturally, the locals couldn't say no and built them a shooting range where they could play soldiers. Shooting range means weapons and ammo, so things that are in short supply around here. I need you to go there and put eyes on it. Scout around the place and check if it's clear. We get some money in a Nice M4. It's got the different foregrip thing on it. Um, so we gotta scout the shooting lanes, shooting lanes, scout the mo uh, motel and the dumping ground. Um, should be pretty straightforward. All right, we're at the LZ for Hunter's Paradise Box Trot One, and I didn't bring meds with me. We need to find the shooting lanes, which is ahead of us. I found the firing lanes. Bond to dead dudes. Kind of want that peak AO one. You never know. I'm not exactly sure where the dumping grounds are. I can't remember for sure. I think they're kind of out back, though. Let's go see. Ooh, free fanny pack. Whoa. I would have guessed that was the dumping grounds, but maybe not. Sounds like there's a landing zone behind me. Go check that out here in a moment. Dumping ground. All right, now we just need to go to the motel. Be to our east here. Anything in there? Ah oh, man, I didn't see anything. Backpack and a chocolate bar? How can you say no to that? Oh shit. <laughs> I haven't seen a single living hostile yet. Oh. Like that was one. Somebody took him out though. People might be farming this area, trying to find keys or whatever. It's also a quest where you have to kill 20 dudes here. What am I stuck on? Oh, goodness. A little branch. Found the motel. There is a quest in this room. At one point in on this table here that you... Pick up a revolver in a wooden box. Right, let's go to the other side. Get that LZ reset. Am 
Might be some guys spawn over here. I don't necessarily need dudes, but chances for keys would be nice, especially the quest 102 key. I don't like this approach. This isn't a good approach. cooking. HP 102. There we go. That's the key we needed. Man, they're black. Don't suppose this is respawn? Doesn't seem like it. Alright, let's go get that LZ. Turn the base and then uh, come back because we'll have another quest for here after that. Oh man, you were in the ground, just your head was sticking out. That's why I shot you. Crazy. And you sprung up like a like a sapling oak wood. Oh shit, I was on mute. That shit's crazy. Yeah, man. Pretty yeah, I was nuts. Just doing my inventory. Yeah, you were like in the ground and only your head was sticking out. And then, like, you happen to have look, uh, the Blue Lagoon or whatever area landing zone? I don't. Uh, I have not quite there yet. Fuck, oh, dude. I've tried walking there twice now and keep getting shot in the face. Like, literally. Oh, man. You can't go through that town. Um, no, you can't. Guns and ammo. Okay, time to look into the weapon situation. Investigate the shooting range thoroughly and try to locate its weapon storage. It's likely to be locked, so you'll need to find a key. Once you get in, check out how many weapons and ammo are there, if any, and report back to me. Hope you understand how much beneficial, er, how much beneficial a fully stocked armory like that would be to our mission here. But still, be careful out there. Manpower is still more important than hardware, and all the guns and ammo in the world will be useless if there's no one left to use them, right? Investigate the weapon storage. Alright, after this quest, should unlock level 2. True Grit Antique Revolver. We can certainly do that while we're there.
We're here, Hunter's Paradise. Sounds like we got some friendlies in the area. Hopefully they'll uh, be able to unlock the uh, weapon storage area. Yo, man, did you open weapon storage? Uh, someone else opened it, but it was fucking picked clean by the time we got here. Oh, cool. I just got the quest for it. Okay, nice. Hell yeah. There's the revolver. Alright, let's get out of here. Turn in this gunny quest. Get a free M4. And gunny level 2. Very nice. Ooh, new t-shirt. So next task we're going to do is shooting gathery. So I'd say we've had just about enough of those assholes occupying the shooting range, wouldn't you agree? It's time for some proper live target practice. Load up your mags, head to Hunter's Paradise, kick some ass, alright? I'm sure they'll never know what hit them. Eliminate 20 hostiles at Hunter's Paradise. Get another decent M4. Some money, experience, rep. Oh man, there's so many people here right now. You here for kills or just looting? Uh, I was here for a sample that I got from the fridge, and then I have to kill the, uh, what's it called, one of like the special guys. Oh, uh, the leader guy? Yeah. I think he's got a special shotgun and a blue shirt. Yeah, and doesn't he have a helmet on or some shit like that? I'm not sure. Okay, I'm just gonna have to keep an eye out. I have no idea where he spawns around here. 
Um, I'm pretty sure I've seen him spawn in, in this area that we're in. Yeah, there was, um, there was only a few guys here, but they weren't him, so... Cool. I'll just keep an eye out. If I see regular guys, I'll try not to... Uh, it's all good, man. I've been here a while. Yep. Alrighty. Hey, yeah, just defend yourself. Do what you need to do. Alright, you too. Sounds good, man. These two guys traded. Okay then. Get your body back? Not yet. I don't know where it went. It's not on the roof? No, it's not up there. Oh, man. Wait, I see it right here. Hell yeah. Isn't this the guy that you were looking for? Uh, he's the only one that looks like that. Yeah, and he's the only one with that, that type of shotgun. Yeah. Well, guess I'm burnt. Sorry, man, I killed him. Ah, now you're all good. It was the last one I needed for my quest. Well, look good. Somebody got something done. Hey, you need anything? Before I get out of yeah. here? I got all my stuff. I just need to uh, put some splints on. I fell pretty hard. You got a splint? I got one. Yeah, I got him. Cool, man. All right, let's turn in the quest. We finally got it done. Buddy, I need your help. Maybe you've already heard, but Hunter's Paradise had some sort of VIP program for those with the deepest pockets. I don't care what sort of fucked up stuff they did, but I was contacted by the boss, and he wants to know what sort of people were in on it. There has to be a list of clients somewhere in that place, so look carefully. Find it and bring it back here. I bet some kind of administrative building should just should be just the spot where they keep something like that. I think I know where this is. Hey, do you have some time right now? I'd really appreciate your help with something. We got another missing person and I need you to find him. You think you can do that for me, please? Ollie Savangsa. He lives near the Northern Resort, and from what his wife told me, he can't work because of his injuries he stained, sustained for his anti-patriarchal behavior, courtesy of the local police force. That poor family has been struggling ever since. Thing is, he disappeared a day before the evacuation even started. Last time somebody saw him, he was heading for the Hunter's Paradise shooting range west of the resort. Please, could you head out there and look for him? I'm sure it will mean the world to his wife and to me. Right, so we're going to get the Brave and up to Snuff. Back at Hunter's Super Paradise, you gotta find the admin building. And then also head all the way back to the range, to the back of the range, to uh, find that missing person guy. You here for kills? 
No, I'm here to get the commander. Okay. What about you? God damn, how many shots does that guy take? Dude, I know. I lit him up with like 15 shots. Yeah, it's all the now blood I'm, spatters. I am bleeding like crazy. He didn't have armor on. What an asshole. Uh, I'm here for the admin building. And then also the guy posted up out back that got shot. Oh, okay. You know what the commander looks like? He's got a red band on his arm and some ta certain tattoos. He also has a... I'm pretty sure he's got the... Like a blue shirt. It's the only one with the blue shirt and a special shotgun. It's like a bright blue shirt. Okay. Yeah, I think he's closer to the shooting range. Got the list. It's quite the M4. Yeah, you'll find this body, and then he'll have a letter behind, underneath him. Look at that. That's pretty crazy. Fell up against that stump. Hello. Hello. Alright, we're turning in this quest for a lab rat. Just gave us some blood and some money. Some blood money. Carnivore. Collect biological samples from Hunter's Paradise. The outcome of your last mission troubled me deeply. It's hard to fathom such atrocities occurring at Hunter's Paradise. Could you please investigate further? I need to confirm if the disturbing implications in the note hold any truth. Please explore the range and collect biological samples from its food supply. I'll conduct a thorough analysis and then we'll be able to uncover the extent of the depravity in that place. Uh, we will do that next time.